A new diplomatic push aimed at cooling tensions with China. Secretary of State Antony Blinken arrived in Beijing today for two days of high stake talks. It's the first U.S. diplomatic mission there in five years. CBS Face the Nation host Margaret Brennan is traveling with them. Secretary Blinken and Foreign Minister Chin Gong, a close ally of President Xi Jinping, tackled a long list of grievances. The U.S. goal? Open communication channels to avoid a military clash. Tension spiked last summer when then House Speaker Nancy Pelosi visited Taiwan. And again in February after the spy balloon shootdown. China's defense chief refuses to speak with U.S. Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin at a time when Beijing is massively expanding its nuclear arsenal. Miscommunication risks a clash. Last month, a Chinese warship came within 150 feet of slamming into an American ship transiting the Taiwan Strait. And in the South China Sea, a Chinese fighter jet buzzed the U.S. Air Force. The divide runs deeper than a failure to communicate. Blinken also pressed authorities to crack down on the flow of fentanyl. That drug is now the number one killer of Americans under the age of 50. Many of the precursor chemicals are made here in China, and the Biden administration wants to slow that down. For Beijing, uh, there may be financial interest here. Uh, the economy is slowing down and reopening. Some of that trade may be helpful to them. The main goal may be a summit between President Xi and President Biden this fall, perhaps as soon as November, in California.